everyone, thanks for watching. We're in Manistee at the VFW post number 4999. Is that correct, Sean? 4499. What's that? 4499. 4499. We're talking about rolling thunder and thunder at the river. With me is John Stocky. Thanks for taking the time. Thank you so much for offering to come out and support us. All right, let's let's start backwards if we shall. Uh, rolling Thunder. What is Rolling Thunder? We are a veterans group that support our veterans. Uh, we get notoriety for uh, the ride to the wall during Memorial Day uh, where there's gathering of about 900,000 motorcycles. It's actually a demonstration ride to fight our government to keep looking for those prisoners of war still missing in action. That's what we're all about. Bringing our brothers home that served and we get them back to their families. Yeah, it's interesting because I grew up in a time where we wore POW bracelets. And it was a big deal for those of us who were not old enough to serve but still wanted to support our veterans and our and our military members. How are we doing on the POW front? Uh, we are surprisingly still bringing veterans home. Actually, there was one that just came back from Grand Rapids uh, all over the United States. They're still looking for them, searching for them, and bringing them back for closures to their family. All right, let's talk about uh, um, Thunder at the River. This is a big event, what is this? Uh, this is a escorted memorial ride. It's raising funds uh, to help our veterans here locally and statewide, all the funds stay right here in the state of Michigan. And we honor the biggest ride, which is called the Pure Thunder Ride, is to honor our veterans that have, have gave their lives for our country and, uh, and those serving overseas as well. Now, talking about Thunder at the River, this is the staging area, the VFW here, uh, for the two escorted rides, correct? Explain yes. that. Uh, the ride we bring, we're bringing in the Michigan-Vietnam Wall, and we're also bringing the Mid-Michigan Eastern Conflict Wall. This is the first time we've done both walls. Uh, we was staging here at the VFW Post, and then we head to the casino where our event is going to be held, and the wall Walls will be set up uh, on Friday and as well as the Sunday. Now, who can participate in the ride? And I asked you this question before you turn the cameras on, thinking that it would just be for veterans. But who? That's not that's not the case. No. Who can participate? Uh, anybody can participate, and we welcome all vehicles to this event uh, for both rides, escorting the walls as well as the Pure Thunder ride, uh, leaving the casino headed up 22. You get a, a fair number of participants, don't you? Uh, last year we had roughly about 200-something bikes for the wall escorts, and the big ride uh, we had roughly around 300 bikes. And you're going to have music as well. What else is going on that day? Uh, we have uh, Big Don's Barbecue. Uh, we nice. have uh, we got a photo booth set up. we got a DJ playing. Uh, the casino has Eli Young Band playing on Saturday evening. Uh, there's all kind of activities going on throughout the day. Thunder at the River in Manistee. Uh, let's go over the dates again. June 15th and 16th. All right. And how can people find out more information about all this? Uh, you could go to our website, www.rollingthunderandthenumber1.com. You could re reach, be reached there. We have flyers available throughout the state at a lot of VFW posts and American Legion posts. All right. Let me just ask you this quickly. Uh, because this is to honor veterans and you're a veteran, how are we doing? Are we getting any better in taking care of our vets? Uh, well, the state just approved uh, building new two new facilities but we really need a hospital up north that's my own opinion yeah. uh, we, we are getting better but it has been very slow in my estimate I mean yeah. it's terribly slow still right. John thank you very much for taking the time uh, thank you so much for coming out all right talking thunder at the river in Manistee I'm Vic McCarty my news 26 and my TV 12.